So Donington Park, British GT Media Day for this season, um, first session for the team complete. Um, you've not been out in the car yet, but from what you've seen, how's it been going? Yeah, really strong start. I think uh, it was pretty tricky conditions out there, so we we sent we sent the pro Seb out, and uh, yeah, he's um, straight up to speed, so he hasn't been driving for over the winter. So um, yeah, I think pretty happy with the car, and uh, yeah, well, um, I'm going to give it a go now in the next session. It's a little bit drier, so. Hopefully we'll get some dry running towards the end of the session and uh, yeah, see where we are. Yeah, absolutely. Pretty horrible weather conditions this morning, so maybe not too bad that you uh, you missed that one. But you, you tell me you're going out fairly soon. Weather is getting better, it's dry at least, but the track I imagine is going to be still pretty slippery, pretty greasy. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I think uh, it's not particularly warm today, so uh, not much sun to get the get the water away. But uh, and I guess there'll be at some point there'll be the threshold where it's not really wet, so it's not really slick. So. Um, I think we'll probably start using some older rain tyres then so we can just destroy them and not wor not worry about them and then uh, yeah yeah see where uh, just to be honest, you just get some track time so yeah and tell me a bit about Donington Park You're on the GP circuit today what kind of challenges does that layout um, throw to you to drivers especially on a day like today uh, I think well I've not actually driven the GP layout I've only done national so um, I'll be able to I can tell you about the first the first half yeah um, yeah I think obviously Crane is, 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 is quite um, it's quite a, a, a confidence corner, I guess. So um, I think that would be that would be one to one to get your head around. And then there's not much rubber down on the track either, so um, it's not it's not really using the wet line traditionally. So, um, but I think yeah, craners and then um, uh, coming onto the back straights and coppice or whatever. I can't actually remember the name of the corner, but um, yeah, just trying to get the traction down there. And then um, for me, it'll be working out the last third of the of the, of the lap this this session. So yeah. Yeah, very much so. And just to finish off, on a complete side note, I've got to say, the livery this year on the car looks absolutely amazing. It's always great in the off-season, all the cars um, being revealed. You must be happy with it, but I'm sure as long as it's quick, you're happy. Yeah, exactly. Well, yeah, you, whenever you put a nice livery on a car, it definitely doesn't make it quicker. But no, it's nice and um, you know, it's got our company sponsor there, so it's good bit of branding for them. And um, yeah, it's UK colours as well, so supporting the country, but uh, yeah. No, it, it, does, it looks smart, but uh, I don't care what it looks like as long as it goes quick. So, Absolutely. Well, best of luck this afternoon. Keep up the good work. Yeah, cheers, mate. Thank you.